Hello and welcome to Heroes of the Horn, a Wheel of Time podcast. I am Sir Matt. And I am Sir Ezra. Welcome to our Wheel of Time book club. The horn has sounded and we have answered the call. Today we are covering The Lord of Chaos, part two, chapters four through six. Yeah, as you know, it feels good to be back in the realm. We took a little bit of a break, right? We probably should have taken a little bit of a break after season one. Uh, yeah. before we jumped to the next book, but we but we did after that anyway. So we did the first episode, took a little bit of a break, came back uh, about a little over a week ago, and did just sort of like a big sort of breakdown, right? Of you know what oh, yeah. we think is going to be, <clears throat> what do we think is going to be happening, right? There was the Avienda casting, Jordan Con. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. Well, now we're back with chapters four through six of Lord of Chaos, and a little bit of news. Um, let me go ahead and get this pulled up. Uh, so I'm looking at a article here from uh, a fellow fan sided podcast, uh-huh. right? Uh, uh, Take the black, right? Um, saying Wheel of Time season two wraps on filming. Um, have some pictures and stuff like that here. 156 shooting days, 14 wonderful makeup crew nationality, 56 makeup arts, 220 COVID tests, 560 makeup uh, fittings over one year on the show spanning over three countries. Um, so, I mean, pretty cool here. Uh, just getting some, uh, getting, getting some pictures and stuff. Right. So if we have the time is done filming now, I think maybe we could actually, in theory, we could actually still get this in 2022, maybe November, like around the same time as season one. But here's the thing. I, I would get it out before people forget about it. I mean, I don't know. Like I, I that sounds kind of mean, but like, I, I, I would just. If you're going to do the show, just just do it. Just pump it out there right. and and keep keep people talking about it and stuff. Because sometimes if it's if it's just show that's new and and it's from a book series people don't know really well, it it, it could just get lost. You know, like Star Wars, we it's always there. You know, we, it's awesome, cool. With the hype is you know major on that. Uh, other fandoms too, but I don't. Uh, you know, I do worry that it's going to go by. It's going to be too long, and then. I, first of all, I just I just worry in general about the show because I want it to be a hit. I want it to be a success. Right. You know? Yeah. I mean, I, I, I think season I do generally believe season two will be better than season one was. Yeah. Um, not really worried about that whatsoever. I will also say that um, I'm with you. I guess my my concern and this was this is one of our concerns going into season one was oh man i really we really hope it came out before house of the dragon and lord of the Rings show and then the witcher was coming so i do feel like it did have a i i still feel like season one was good you know we didn't yeah. like you know sort of the ending of it but i still felt like it it could be good so i mean season two sounds like it's a pretty big production right and yeah, amazon amazon loved it it had good it had good numbers i mean season one did have really good yes it did really yeah. really, really good numbers so i mean it, it, it it was a success right i i saw somebody like i just typed in wheel of time news and someone was like you know people are always trying to theorize what when's it going to come out somebody said october november i don't know if it's gonna come out that i mean yeah maybe i mean november i don't know but so, some some sites were saying will it come out um this october but that's right when the everything else is going on with the Lord of the Rings and um, yeah, it's going to come out after Lord of the Rings. Yeah, so um, Lord, and Lord of the Rings will be so, going, I think, through September, October, maybe November. It's probably going to come out right after Lord of the Rings. Yeah. Okay. I mean, hey, that's great. You know what I mean? I don't. I mean, if it's, I mean, if they, if they're done filming right now, I mean, there's potential reshoots and everything. But I mean, Game of Thrones finished filming and what? uh middle of february Mm -hmm. and we're getting it in august so march april may june july august about six months yeah so if it's done filming now what's five plus six is yeah 11 november seems about right let's call it you know let's 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 break some news here all right let's say it's coming that they're gonna be releasing it in november right after yeah ordering show i think that's when they should do it so because I was like, oh, man, because remember, we, we had said oh, it's probably gonna be we, we, we were thinking 2023, not, you know, right. At even what point during 2023 It's just, yeah, get it out there. I want it out. I think it did benefit from. Well, I mean, it didn't benefit. But remember, they said that, like. Because of the way the pandemic and stuff, they were already they were writing season two 
like when they hadn't even finished season one yet. And it's been right. greenlit for three seasons. Right. Yes. Yeah. In terms of what Amazon, what Amazon has ordered. So we know, we know for a fact we are getting three seasons minimum. Yeah. Yeah. That's exciting. And that's, that's good. I, again, sometimes I'm in disbelief. I, uh, you know, I'm always just like, wow, we have wheel of time. There once was a time where we didn't have it and, and we have it now. So it's sort of mind boggling to think that they did it. We've all seen it and we want to see more of it. You know, the casting stuff has been exciting and where we're going to go. I think the last thing before we dive into some of the chapters here, but I, I think there's a lot of people, I don't know if it was Ray or someone said this at Jordan Con, but the idea is there's gonna be a lot of changes. They're really mm-hmm. pulling some some stuff out uh, for, for season two. Major. Yeah. I'm yeah. Cool. If you're gonna do it, do it. You know what I mean? Go big or go home. Well, I mean, hey, if you're if this whole thing is gonna be about, I think what did he say about I think he said about fifty episodes or so, or um fifty to sixty episodes was where he felt like Right is what they would get. All, yeah. is what is what they would get, and we sort of broke it down. And I think we said, well, you know, if we're getting eight episodes a season, then what that and, and, and low high end, it ended up being you know like six or seven seasons is what the seven seasons I think is what we ultimately sort of came uh, in our number. She says, um, so I mean, okay, so we're seven, you know, whatever the I don't know what the math is on that, but. We got it. We are going to have to make a big jump next season. Probably get through book two, three, into some, into a little bit of book four. That'd be cool. I, I, I'm, I'm cool with it. I mean, people are going to be like, there's already such significant changes to season or to yeah to season one from book to show. So you can't go back now. I mean, they've already made some major decisions there. So yeah, I'm, I'm cool to see what they're what they're going to do.